William Kakwamba, the prodigy kid who built a windmill in Malawi, Africa, at the age of 15, just using scrap pieces and his own intellect. But how did he do it? And how does his windmill work? First, let's look over what a windmill is. A windmill is a tall building that transforms the motion force of the wind into electrical energy. But how? Well, thanks to electromagnetism. Yes, you heard right, they use magnets. Magnets generate a magnetic field, like this. When the windmill blades start to move, it triggers a mechanism that makes the magnet move up and down. When you add a copper wire to the equation, boom, electricity. All thanks to electromagnetic induction. Now let's talk about William's windmill. For the blades, he used PVC pipes. He melted and fluttered them, and then attached the resulting blades to a tractor fan. After that, he connected it all with his father's broken bike. The tractor fan was right where the pedals are, so when the wind moved the blades, the chain would also move the bicycle tire. Then the dynamo. This is where the magic happens. He attached it to the tire, so its movement would activate the magnets inside the dynamo. Last but not least, he needed a wooden tower to support the windmill up high, so he used three locks and tied them together with branches and nails.